Yeah, we love highlighting people doing interesting things. Uh, young filmmaker Kelly Kali is here. She just won the 2018 Student Oscar for her narrative short, making her the first African-American woman ever to win that award. Congratulations. Her short film, uh, Lalo's House, follows the story of two Haitian girls who are abducted and thrown into underground prostitution network posing as a Catholic orphanage. Here's a clip from the trailer. A warning, it is intense. Wow, that's a clip from Lalo's house. Kelly Kali is here with us this morning. Good morning. Good morning. Congratulations Thank to you, you first so of all. Uh, what you. what are you trying to accomplish with this? What's sort of the main point? So with this film, it began. Um, I used to my background is in anthropology and film. I was working in Haiti, looking into children's rights and living conditions before the earthquake. When the earthquake happened, I went back to help, and I caught wind of an orphanage um, that was posing as a Catholic orphanage, where the nun who was also posing. Uh, was allowing four men to come in and sleep with the little girls. So mm. I investigated this over, gosh, next year will be 10 years of me working on this. I used that fo that footage, the documentary footage, to get accepted into USC. Mm. And Congratulations. Thank Fight you. on, as we Fight like to on. say. Yeah. And that's where um, I was encouraged to turn it into a fiction narrative. And um, me and my co-writer uh, began to write it, and it became Lalo's House. So what was the process then of getting the funding, of getting out there, of actually doing this? Because it can't be cheap. No. So I, um, people ask me, well, who do you want to play the nun? And I immediately said Garcelle Beauvais because people know her as a very loving and um, nurturing person. And people who tend to do child trafficking aren't always what we think they are. So I thought she's perfect. She's Haitian. And I sought her out, got help, and she brought in Jamie Foxx's help. And we also did a huge crowdfunder. You'll see in our credits, there are so many people. It took a village to make this film. So oftentimes when a short film is really successful, then that's used as a way to get distribution or to try to make it a yes. feature length film. Yes. Is that something you're looking to do now? That is absolutely something we're looking to do. We want to expand it and we're hoping that um, we're in consideration for the um, Academy Award now in the shorts, the live action shorts category. And so with that, if we were to get a nomination, um, we hope that that will give um, momentum so that we can move into the future. What did that mean, though, to win the student Oscar? Oh, it was, I mean, to work on this for almost a decade um, and to be recognized by the Academy at the highest level for my thesis film, I, I was just overwhelmed with joy and gratitude to see that perseverance can pay off, especially in subject matters um, like this that really need to get out to the world. So what can people do to help these girls and how big a problem is this? It's, it's huge. It's here in Los Angeles. There's young ladies. I speak on panels. I've spoken on panels throughout the U.S. Um, I've spoken on panels here in L.A. where young girls have been trafficked through L.A. up into Vegas and um, they've witnessed girls being put on crates in Long Beach. Um, they, it's, it's a big deal and the best thing to do is to, one, um, like go to Polaris.com. They are very, very active in helping to bring awareness to these issues. And, pe and organizations like that can really help guide you. It's really being aware and, and um, looking at things that just don't feel right and asking questions because that has saved a lot of children before. And, and thank you for helping to do that. I hope that Oscar voters are watching this morning. <laughs> and uh, we hope you see you on Oscar night as well. Oh, that would be so, that, that would be a prayer come true. Congratulations. Yes. Yeah. And on behalf of the USC community, we're all very happy for you as well. <laughs> Thank, Thank you so, you so much. So much.